All right, welcome to Breen Marine, where we have vehicles too. This is a 2011 FJ Cruiser, Toyota, of course. One of the most amazing rigs, in my opinion, that Toyota ever built. Built on the uh, Forerunner frame here. Uh, starting out here at the front for condition, um, this had a clear bra, like with a clear vinyl on it, so there's a little bit of a transition where the clear was on there and the paint had faded a little bit, but you can't see it unless you get it just right here. Uh, looking over across the, the uh, hood, we have a little bit of fading here up on the paint uh, on this top plastic here. There's a little bit of fading here on there. And then I found a couple little nicks in the windshield, but not too many, not really big cracks or anything. There's a little one that was repaired right here. Looks like it had been repaired, a chip. As you know, these are prob these these are prone to windshield incidents with them being so flat. The other uh, thing we have the uh, sides here. There's on the door. There's a couple of, of nicks here on the edge of the door. You'll kind of see, but otherwise it's actually really straight. There's very very few damages overall in the in in the body on this. Okay, going on, and you notice this one does not have a roof rack, but they're very easy to put on because you can find the factory ones easily, but there's also really cool options for other ones, and they just bolt on. Just make sure you seal those bolts. You'll see some of these have water damages on the uh, uh, headliner because they leak, so you always need to make sure you put the proper sealant on those. Tires are in pretty darn good shape. These are two uh, 85 7017s. And then the Toyota stock wheels look awesome too. What's that? Wheel spacer. It has wheel spacer on them to bring those out a little bit. And so they sit out just nice. They have a really cool looking stance. You'll see in the photos there, the look of that. Uh, going around, there's a couple of touched up scuffs here on these. These are actually really easy to replace with the black ones or you can keep those ones on there either way. Uh, they're actually like $50, $60. I replaced them on, on my personal FJ. All right, uh, here's the uh, camera, hides up inside of here. This is the spare tire. Uh, we've got the tow package, which is really rad. Uh, lights there. Uh, we have actually like really no rust. This frame is very in very good shape. That's something you always want to look at on any of the Toyotas is aged. Some of them have rough issues if they came from the east, which this one did not. Okay, look in the back here. As you know, these things are awesome. You can always clean them out really good. They have the plastics. This one also has the sub and it has the inverter so you can plug in your 120 volt, 115 volt items in there. Okay, a couple scuffs on this side. This one's a little bit deeper. Like I said, these ones, this whole bumper assembly comes off actually pretty fast. They're pretty easy to change, but you can ride with it, go with it. This right here has some scuffs on the black plastic. Those could probably be sanded, but it's not that bad. Uh, looking down this side of it, I mean, we've got some, those are pretty buff outable, pretty easy to remove. Uh, maybe one a little bit, no. That scrapes off, so that's not too bad on that there. There's a little fold here in the fender. It looked like it got heated up and repaired. You can see a little bit on that plastic fender on there. The rub. There's a slight rub back here on the tire when you crank it all the way in reverse. Uh, you can get a little bit of rub. That's due to wheel spacers if you don't want that. Put those out. We can pull those off for you if you'd like. And uh, no rub, but the look is really nice to have the water stance. Let's go ahead and start this up. Well, first, let's look inside, get the overall view of the inside. Removable floor mats in here with the awesome rubber floors. Seat condition, a little bit of wear on the side, on the seat here. Usually those have a split, so this one's probably more highway mileage to because of that, not having that. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, show the inside here. Uh, all, all pretty much stock here, everywhere. It does have, it does have the ability to turn off the uh, traction control. 
and an analog system and then also has the uh, rear differential lock and the A-Track and the A-Track is a it, you'll have to look that up it's a really cool option here's our inverter power right there as well and then the parking sensors uh, if you want to utilize those or not uh, four-wheel drive of course always check these FJs because they're not all four-wheel drive and then uh, stereo sounds actually really good it's, as a stock stereo it's good but uh, uh, yeah and then I just love the controls on these FJs it's one of my favorite things because you don't have to like sit there and look for buttons it's just like big caveman here turn 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 you can get to that all right uh, clock compass we also have the uh, the uh, the gauges up there we have the auto tenting mirror and it does have a reverse camera here and then we have steering wheel controls as well here for the volume for the stereo as it also has the Bluetooth for your uh, with the microphone um, RSC off so if you're off-roading you can turn off the rear and side airbags by pushing that button so that if you fall over they don't go off or if you get too tilted they don't they don't uh, go off there okay firing it up no check engine lights uh, when this came in it hasn't had any there's no recent codes on it at all so we're good that way 184,642 on the mileage always a really cool area up here engine here so you can hear that the oil was just changed yeah it's got fresh oil in it ready to go that way fresh filter cabin filter we just replaced those. Got a Toyota battery in here. Uh, it's hot and peppy. Uh, got good voltage. Here, the engine's nice and smooth. Sounds like, sounds like a perfect running Toyota. So there you have it. Any questions or anything, hit us up online if you have questions, or we're, all, we're always happy to grab our phones and go get video of anything that, that might have overlooked. We're always happy to do that. Uh, it's just Jackson and I. Show them yourself, Jackson, there. All right on Highway 101 here, uh, Boat Shop. We got this. We are an auto dealer, licensed auto dealer. And, uh, yeah, come on down. Let's, uh, let's see if we can uh, get you a deal on this thing. I think it's going to be a really rad unit. I love these, so I'm very passionate. So if you have any questions, hit me up. I love to talk about them.